But um, yeah, so I'm getting ready to uh, blueprint and assemble everything and uh, hopefully get her back up shortly. <laughs> Nah, we're we're making the race. <laughs> we're we're definitely racing. Uh, I accept no excuse. It's pretty much um, the it's the factory all pan, but we we cut out the 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 bottom portion and welded in a Rips Racing extended sump, which is like a larger capacity pan onto it, so it holds a lot more oil and it's baffled. And then uh, yeah, everything's everything's powder coated. But, um, all right, man. Well, I'll, I'll get cracking on this. And I'll yeah 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 she's, she's getting some stuff she actually recorded me right now so she'll record everything <laughs> mm -hmm. so this is the uh the pro series uh platinum racing products trigger kit gives you uh 36 uh minus two uh, on the crank for better crank resolution and um one on the cam so uh this is pretty much their top of the line kit um and you know one of the best kits on the market for these engines uh works very well and uh you know they use it in time attack racing and everything so we'll have a spot spot on you know accuracy and timing so that's always a plus especially when it comes to rbs because they got a lot of uh issues with timing scatter um with the cam driven crank sensor Um, all right, yeah, so we're gonna let you get cranking and I'll come back. Right now, everything is literally in all of its beautiful pieces. We're gonna do blueprint, mm -hmm. measure, make sure everything's good. Yeah, I'll get the engine, the block on the stand. What up? You gonna be on YouTube, bitches? What up? <laughs> Tell me what you're gonna do real quick. I'm gonna, gonna get the block on the stand and start, you know, slapping stuff together uh, lightly to blueprint and measure everything and stuff. So we'll get that going. All right, cool. Later. Later. Right now I'm getting set up and getting ready to check the crankshaft end plate. Um, I've already got the oil clearance set on the mains and the rods. Um, I've already set the piston ring gap and checked over everything else, piston to wall clearance and everything. So, so far everything is looking good and um, you know everything is where I want it to be um, after playing around with the bearing sizes and stuff. So, um, so far so good and hopefully we can get this uh, bottom end put together tonight so um what what else i guess to get it complete the sucker the girdle what do you mean girdle on crank in well yeah start putting it together yeah and like for real for real yeah actual yeah. not just like test yeah, not, fitting not dummy assemble for blueprint okay so this is dummy yeah it doesn't look dummy though <laughs> <laughs>
So, wife's go short of us. One uh, wrist pin lock. I don't know how. Of course, we end up with that set of pistons that's missing one. Um, yeah, you could see it brand new in the bag, clear as day, because the bag is see-through, and it just had one inside instead of two. So, um, I'm going to get five of the piston and rods in there. Um, and then I'm going to go pick up a set of wrist pin locks and we'll come back and probably get the sixth one in tomorrow and get the rest of the stuff going. So just got to work with what we got. Did I, um, I, well, thank, thankfully, uh, oh, and you painted those, so looks good. Well, I would say 90% of this job is problem solving. <laughs> yeah. And typically they're problems that you know we have no control over or that we did not create it's just like part of the business it's part of this shit parts delays wrong parts getting sent um <clears throat> damaged parts uh quality issues yeah. it's, it's all Shitty part of parts. it yeah, yeah it's all part of it so um we're used to that and uh we just hate to see when it happens when uh when we're in like a time crunch to try to make um this race in two weeks. But, you know, shit happens, right, Bob? Say, that's not your name. Your name's Shelby. Why are you sleeping under here? Just deal with whatever the hell we got. <laughs> with a smile. Yeah. Smile my ass. <laughs> Now, if I recall, uh, Jorge specifically asked me to record this, so sorry for his attitude, Jorge. <laughs> yeah. Well, anybody would understand well. I'm pissed off. Is that my drink? Is that my beer? Happy Sunday! Oh. Yeah, fun stuff. All right, so um, oh, you have yes. here it is. Let's so see. we have the infamous wrist pin locks. So, just kind of stole them from Doug's bicycle pistons, and I replaced them. Um, these are in stock, and I can get a set, but it wouldn't be here. It wouldn't even ship till Monday, and at best, could be here by Tuesday, which would have been like I don't know, three days down the drain of doing nothing. And so, yeah, uh, so just stolen from Doug and I'll get him a new set and uh, we can keep rolling on Jorge's engine. So I'll get the last uh, piston and rod mounted together and then put it inside the block and then we'll put the head and get everything together and just kind of keep chopping away. Um, kind of bums me out that we got shorted one pin. Um, yeah, you can see there are two. In there. Yeah, and this one there's two. Um, 
but literally the last one it was you know unsealed and then unsealed. i mean uh, un it was sealed and just one and it looks like this one is actually i don't i don't know if that's like the date and who quality checked it but this one looks like uh, looks like it was quality checked or if that's if that's correct by the exact same person who had the one so i don't know chris or yeah. Creasy. Creasy. All right. Thanks, Creasy, for short. Hold on. Up. Wait. Where's the other one? Did we take that trash out, or do you have it in here? No. Oh, you're right. Oh, this is it. This is part of it. Uh, uh, there we go. Yeah. yeah exactly. So it I, probably I isn't. Yeah. yeah. I, I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, it's the same thing. Same. Yeah. I, I don't know. Or maybe yeah. they're just the packaging. Oh, well, yeah, maybe. Yeah, because well, it'd be the same date too, 421. I, I don't know. Yeah, okay. Either way, what well, Creasy's to blame. <laughs> Creasy cost us two hours in travel last night. Yeah. <laughs> it's all good. We get it. Oh, there's six. All right, so we got all the pee stains in. <laughs> You know that came from your brother, right? Pee stain? Yeah. That's what he calls pistons? No, because remember he had uh, the FDRX7 and on the license plate it said no pistons, <laughs> no but he didn't pistons. spell the words out all the way, so it was <laughs> N-O-P-S-T-N, and people kept calling NS, it no, no yeah. pee stains. No pee stains, <laughs> that's right. <laughs> I forgot about that, that's so funny. So you're gonna just slap the head on? Yeah, just slap it on with a like this. Yep. Um... <laughs> What? Where's the head gasket? Uh, oh, I'll get that up front. There you go. Nitto head gasket. <laughs> this thing's gonna lift. Tiger. <laughs> no. It's, it's probably one of the best uh, ceiling head gaskets you can buy. thing is thick. So these multiple layers of, what is it made of? Metal? Steel. Steel? Yep. They, um, when it, oh see there's dog hair on this. When they heat up, like when it gets hot, does it expand then? And create um, like no, a... No, so what, what, they, what, the, what it is is um, the multi-layered steel is a lot stronger than like your typical graphite composite head gasket. Um, and they have sort of like a, a fire ring around the cylinders as well. Um, so, you know, they really require a mirror finish on the block in the head, but when, you know, put together in the right application, these head gaskets are, you know, they, they work, they work very well. Um, if it was a situation where it's like, we weren't gonna deck the block and we were just pulling the head because they like lifted the head or something, of, you know, of that nature, we weren't pulling the block out of the car. I usually recommend doing an OEM head gasket just because if we're not going to get the block decked and the head decked together at the same time to give you that mirror finish, you know, putting a multi-layer steel head gasket in a situation like that um, because they're not very forgiving when it comes to, you know, surface prep um, can lead to other issues down the road. But like I said, in the situation where both surfaces are prepped properly, um, they're, you know, they're unbeatable. Top, top notch. Top notch. <laughs> all right all right well i'm gonna set this up and let you do your thing man i can't help you with any of this right with any of the head stuff uh yeah you can actually the bolts yep put the bolts in again i have jobs okay i have limited jobs but nonetheless i have jobs <laughs> he trusts me a little bit yeah <laughs> What is it? Give yourself some credit. Yeah, yeah, what is it? Level one lube tech here. Sleeper yeah, lube okay. tech. All Actually, right. I don't even do oil changes, so I'll just be... We have to come up with an interesting name, like Bolt Retriever. No. no. <laughs> Ratchet on, Girl. No. no. <laughs> that, is not, that is not a positive thing to say. Okay, we'll work on the name.
slap this sucker on. Um, I guess uh, you're gonna have to give me a hand with this. Okay. Yeah, you know, with that side of the head, what we're gonna do is we're gonna crunch around the whole finger and we'll make sure we put it down and we get the bolts to the holes instead of missing the snap. Alright, so we have most of the lung block assembled, still have the timing components to do and water pump, but um, everything is just about put together and it's a complete long block, um, just about there. So we'll keep on chopping away at getting the accessories put on and everything buttoned up and uh, you know, just keep on going with it. Well, that looks good. Mm -hmm.
we about to do mm -hmm. now? Uh, just get the timing stuff put together for the PRP trigger kit and timing belt and yada yada, all the good stuff. I've got the cam gears on, timing belt on and everything. Um, the PRP Pro Series cam crank trigger kit. Got the sensor mounted, the gap set and everything. So I'm just trying to button everything up and get everything on and um, you know, keep everything moving. Looks uh, pretty good, thanks. Eh? Yeah, she's coming together. Yeah. Not too shabby. I'm gonna put this cam plate on after I just took the gear. I work through the night tonight. Get some accessories on. Yeah. It really shouldn't be much longer before I get all that. <laughs> this was probably the most time consuming stuff. Well, that and I still have to degree the cams. Mm -hmm. Got your sugar uh, intake. On, right? Spit. Yeah. So, let's go one on one. Uh, she's coming along. She's fighting me, but she's coming. All the good ones fight. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's what to say. So, how'd you do today? Uh, Sunday fun day. Yeah, what is it, 11 o'clock on a Sunday? Um, it's not bad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Especially when you haven't had a day off in what, six months? That's um, called being a business owner. Yeah, the joys. Shout out to all the small business owners. It's a fucking grind, mm -hmm. but at the end of the day, we do love yeah. it. Um, so, Engine's all done and complete, uh, ready to get put in. So uh, tomorrow, I'll uh, we'll end up uh, getting Jorge's car back over here from the other shop and um, get it set up to drop the motor in. Whew. A lot of work. Good job. <laughs> Hell yeah, man. Good job. Looking snazzy. The um, wrinkle black really looks great. Um, Ryan really fucking did a great job on this, I'll say. Phew. It does, I'm excited. All right. Night, y'all. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> I just cleaning. Yep, we're waiting to be back here at 9 a.m. Hell yeah. Gotta get all the pieces. Maybe like 9.15 in all reality. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> well, we get the Cresta back tomorrow, so. Oh, okay, yeah, good. So we get the Cresta back tomorrow. Got a lot of wiring to do. <laughs> that is... hmm? A lot of wiring to do. Oh, yeah, that's gonna be the fun part, yeah. Yeah, because I gotta move the fuse box to the trunk, so that's gonna be uh, very fun. But we'll get her done. All right, until then. Look at, uh, pressure is ready there. Shelby, Shelby, you ready? You wanna go home? Yeah? All right, then I gotta mop real quick. <laughs> 